Fashionistas are my favorite Barbie line, but there's one area where they're lacking. Articulation. The standard five points just doesn't cut it for me. So let's see what body swap options there are for the latest wave of fashionistas. Fashionista 194 and Fashionista 197 have very similar skin tones, but there is a bit of a difference. 194 has a bit more orange undertones, but I think you could probably get away with a head swap here. 197 has the common Millie skin tone of the pink pants yoga made to move. You'll see the skin tone on a lot of Millie dolls, but not all of them. For example, the hiker made to move has a bit of a darker skin tone just by a hair. They'll still work, they're very similar, but they are a little different. You could also put 197 on the baseball made to move. There are a lot of Millies who will fit 197 and 194 is pretty close to that skin tone. Fashionista 195 has the same skin tone as the Claudette BMR 959. This means the Fashionista 186 has another made to move body option now, which I'm very excited about. However, you will then lose her curviness. 195 does have more reddish undertones than the floral yoga made to move, but she has cooler undertones than Fashionista 166. I was hoping to put Fashionista 198 on looks model seven, but they're not an exact match. 198 has more gray and red undertones than looks model number seven, which means that the purple pants is not an exact match either. Neither is Fashionista 166, who has more reddish undertones. So 198 just doesn't have an exact match, but I think I am still gonna try her on looks model number seven and see if it's something that I can live with. For a few other comparisons, here she is with Fashionista 195 and the floral ponytail made move. In happier news, Fashionista 199 has several exact skin tone matches, including the tall basketball player, curvy dancer, and the green pants yoga made to move. So 199 has lots of body type and body donor options. Fashionista 200 also doesn't have an exact skin tone match. She's in between the green pants and the floral bun yoga, but she's not an exact match for either. Looking at these two, I would put 200 on the green pants yoga, but, but she does have more red undertones than the green pants. I wanted to put her on a curvy and was wondering how she would look with Looks Model 11 skin tone, but it's not an exact match either. Mm, I wonder about the curvy dancer. I may try it out and just see how it looks. On camera, they look pretty close, but in person, the difference is more noticeable. Fashionista 201 has several body swap options. You could put her on the floral bun yoga made to move, or the brunette soccer player, or looks model number 12. Any of these dolls would be a great match, but you would be losing the Brooklyn body type that 201 has. 201's skin tone is a hair darker than the green pants yoga and all the other dolls with this skin tone, just as a quick little note. Fashionista 202 has several body swap options. You could put her on the floral curvy yoga made to move, the BMR 1959 Tango doll, or on the purple top. On camera, you can see that 202's body is a little pink compared to these dolls, but her head actually doesn't match her body as well as it would match these other donor bodies. Fashionista 196 has a new Ken skin tone. It's right in between the BMR 1959 green haired Ken and Fashionista 167 and looks model number nine. Fashionista 203 is actually a perfect match for 196. And here you can see them compared to these other skin tones. I haven't decided yet if I'm gonna make the swap, but it's nice to know that I can, if I want to. Fashionista 204 does not have a skin tone match. He is a shade deeper than looks model number four, who is currently the deepest Ken skin tone for made to move dolls. So here are my final body swaps. I put the head of 197 on the body of 194. 
on camera it looks fine in person it's a little off but it's good enough for me i put the head of 198 on the body of looks model number seven it's not a perfect match but i think if i style it correctly with some high necked clothing it'll look fine and it's close enough for me i put 199 on the tall basketball player perfect match looks great could not recommend more and I get to keep her tall body, which is a plus for me. Finally, I put the head of 200 on the curvy dancer. Not a perfect match. You can definitely tell there's a difference in skin tone, but I really wanted to give her articulation and I really wanted her to be curvy. So I'm gonna just live with the slight difference. And I think if I put the right outfits on, also some high necked things, it'll be passable and I'm happy with it. These four are some of my top favorite from this wave, so I'm really excited to get them with Made to Move Articulation. Which dolls are you excited to rebody? Let me know in the comments down below, and thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in my next video.